Welcome, in front of me is a POCO F3 and today I'll show you how to enable and set up the do not disturb mode. And to get started, pull down your notification panel and look for the DND toggle, which is right here. This is a short version of do not disturb. And once you find it, hold it. This will take us to uh, almost the settings. So we need to scroll down a little bit to the do not disturb, simply tap on it. And here we have access to all the settings. So we have the toggle right at the top to turn it on and off. Then below that we have always or when device is locked, meaning uh, the do not disturb mode is gonna work either all the time or once you turn it on or only when uh, you, when you're not using the device. So when you're holding it in a hand and using it, uh, the do not disturb mode will basically be disabled, which is a little bit of a weird way of dealing with it, but you have the choice here. You can pick, maybe it suits you more. Anyway, below that we have the allow incoming calls. So we can allow calls from anyone, contacts, favorite contacts, or no one. And then below that we have notify about repeated callers, uh, which mm, allows people to reach you, uh, assuming they call twice within a 15 minute period. So with this on, if someone does that, calls you twice within a 15 minute period, they will basically bypass the allow incoming calls from, as an example, no one. So in theory, no one should be able to call me no matter what, but this will allow them to reach me. Now, this is a good option in terms of emergencies. Usually people call you quite frequently uh, just to get, get hold of you. So this will allow them to actually get your attention. Otherwise you would have zero knowledge of someone trying to reach you. And then, Lastly, we have the schedule, which allows you to set up a schedule. So do not disturb mode turns on and off automatically based on a given time and day of the week that you will set it to. So let's leave the settings for now and simply go to the toggle. So assuming you didn't go with the scheduled uh, schedule, uh, all you need to do now is simply tap on the toggle to turn it on manually. And once you turn it on manually, you do need to remember to turn it off, otherwise your device will be permanently in do not disturb mode, which you might not want. So as you can see, right now it's enabled. You can also see once you uh, minimize it, or well, the shade, you can see the little moon icon right here. That is to signify that it is right now enabled. And once you're done with it, all you need to do is find the toggle once more, tap on it, and this will make the device go back to the normal mode. So that is how you would enable the do not disturb mode, disable it, set it up. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.